Hi there folks. I just thought I'd share this with you. I've just bought this from eBay. It was £1.47 with delivery and that's roughly two US dollars. Now its name on eBay is a big load of gobbledygook as quite often a lot of the China items are. So for the purpose of this video I'm going to call it an EDC Key Carabiner. Now as you can see it's got a bottle opener on it, pry bar, it's got a little hole here so you can attach further keys I'm guessing um, maybe with one of them or something similar now I quite like this I think it's great now the only bit of criticism I can sort of give it is for your old style keys like this I don't think they've supplied these screws slash bolts I don't think they've supplied enough of them. I think, quite frankly, I know it's a bit greedy to say, but it wouldn't hurt to have some, maybe, three centimetres long. Now, I think three centimetres, you could put literally that many keys on it, it would be great. Now, in the packet, it came, it came with these little rubber donuts I'm going to call them donuts because that's basically what they look like. Now, if these were more square cut, they wouldn't squash out like this. As you can see, they're squashing out and misshaping. Now, if they'd have made these more like a thick set washer in um, rubber, this wouldn't happen. I don't think they'd splay out as much. Also, it came with some really, really thin washers. Now, these are good. I think these are really fit for purpose because... They don't take up too much space. Now, I'll show you how many keys I've got on it, if you haven't already figured. It's got three. Now, I think in this style of key, you could get two more on quite easily. Because, as you can see, there's going to be some give on it. So there's more room. Now, you could also reduce the amount of these rubber donuts. But... As you can see, it's like a bit of a friction fit. So for it to function really well, you'll want to have them on. Because it just stops them spinning around and slopping all over the show. Now, with these style keys, it, it just doesn't work. I'm a bit disappointed because that's what I wanted it for, to get them all on. But I'd, like I said previously, I think they should really have supplied a different variety of these bolt slash screws. Now, this is threaded, this bar, so there's no extra nuts or anything like that. And I have played with this quite a lot. Um, I've had them off and on loads and loads of times until I figured it out and got it set up the way I wanted it. But I think for £1.47, you can't grumble. Now, it keeps all your keys together, and you can quite easily attach additional things to here. Maybe you using another small carabiner. Or, quite simply, just hook some more on. It's quite easy. Now, this spring here isn't that strong. As you can see, it's just using the wire to work against itself like that. There's no spring on it as such. It is adequate because, as you can see, They've got a little bit milled out here, so there's no chance of these getting behind at all. So, I think this is quite good. If they could supply these with these longer bolts, so you can get all your keys on, it'd be a cracking bit of kit. For £1.47 as well, it really is an invaluable piece of kit really, to keep all your stuff together. Now you could quite easily just clip this onto your belt loop or something similar but I just had to share it really because I like stuff like this that keeps all your stuff together and as you can see if you've got say this is my Fura, Fura pen, this is in stainless if you've got things like this it all can match so you could literally stick all your silver and grey stuff together and it'll all go together nicely so I really like this and I, I had to show it. I know it's not really a knife review, but 
I don't mind sharing little bits of EDC gear, and I'm sorry for those who aren't interested, but I think really, for what it is, it's a great bit of kit. So, thanks for your time people, and goodbye.